Welcome Virgos, I'm the Empress, welcome back. Let's get into you guys in January mid-month, all right? Let's see what energy is coming towards my Virgos. Please give me a message for Virgos. Please give me a message for my Virgos. Sun, moon, and rising Virgos, please. Sun, moon, and rising Virgos. Ooh, all right. Looks like you guys have been patient, patiently planning on something. Okay. Oh, you guys got victory and success. Oh, you got something successful coming on. But look, you got to make the right decision. Okay. You have to make the right decision in order for this that you've been planning on to come to fruition. All right. So make sure you're making, you're looking at all your options. Okay. All right. One more card for Virgos, please. One more card for Virgos. One more card for Virgo, please. What other message is there for Virgos from January 15th through the 31st? January 15th through the 31st. 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 All right, we have universe, all right? So you guys are going to be closing chapters, okay? Closing chapters. All right, so let's see. At the bottom of the deck, we have the hangman. So you guys are just patiently waiting. I see this. You guys have just been patiently waiting. Y'all waiting on something, um, something that y'all have been planning, okay? This energy is most definitely plotting and planning your next move, okay? Because you want your next move to be your best move, okay? Even if you have to close out some chapters, you're willing to do that. I know. Virgos, let's see. Let's get a read. Ooh, Emperor. That jumped out. Ooh, ooh. Okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm getting someone in high places. Okay. You could be dealing with an Aries or a Libra. Gemini or an Aquarius. Ooh, you guys got some type of opportunity. A golden opportunity. Okay, something that you may not want to miss out on. Okay. This could be dealing with something. This is someone that is in a high position. Okay. Because we got the Emperor, Aries, this energy. Or this is feeling dominant or feeling like you have everything under control. Maybe some of you guys need to, you know, the challenge could be to try to balance this out. But when I see these two cards together, I see, um, I think about someone in a very high position. Uh, opportunity presented itself in the past with this Ace of Pentacles. Could be something financial. Could be anything. But a grand opportunity presented itself in the past, okay? Okay, then we got a lots of um, major arcanas here. Well, no, we just got Justice and, I know, Emperor as well. And the Hierophant. Okay, you could be dealing with the Taurus, but I'm sensing that there's going to be lots of going back and forth communication coming in, lots of communication getting ready to come in, okay? Lots of communication getting ready to come in, somebody getting ready to walk away. Some communication is getting ready to come in, okay? And this is something that's big. Something big is, is occurring here, okay? What is the future energy? The Knight of Pentacles, Capricorn's energy, all right? But the, this is things kind of taking its time. And you, you're possibly hoping that things would pick up and, and speed up. But you may feel like things are moving. The process is moving slow. But you're hoping that things speed up. Okay, what is this? Why is the Emperor here? Why is the Emperor here? Okay. We got the Ten of Wands. Maybe someone is too controlling. Maybe someone needs to let go of control. We got someone walking away here. 
the Eight of Cups. I got Pisces is energy. We got the Eight of Cups, Queen of Cups, and the Moon. All right, so someone's possibly too controlling, okay? It could be you. You could be feeling like, you know, maybe I'm trying to hold on too tight to the situation. Maybe I need to let go of control and let things just be the way they are. Why is the Justice card here? Okay, Justice and the Chariot. Lots of major outcomes here. We got the Magician and something is making you worried a little bit. Okay, maybe you're feeling worried about a situation that possibly is involving the court system, the uh, government. Why is the Knight of Swords here? Okay. Someone here, we got the Queen of Pentacles, which is you guys' energy. Somebody is wishing, maybe you're wishing you would have waited. Okay, maybe something happens out all of a sudden. Okay, and now you're looking back at it, at it wishing that you would have waited. Why is the Ace of Pentacles here? Okay, why is the Ace of Pentacles here? King of Swords, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, Energy. Lots of big energy here, like big people. People, like when I say big people, I'm not talking like someone big in weight, but I'm just saying like someone that is like an, an authority figure, okay? Opportunity has presented itself. For some of you, this could be involved in the court system. I'm getting the King of Swords, like with the, as far as like a lawyer. This emperor could be a judge. Why is the Hierophant here? Hierophant, 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 judgment. Okay, someone's judging you. Someone's judging you. Maybe you feel judged. Like someone's holding you to some type of standard. And it, it, you may feel like this person or this is just too controlling. Okay. You may feel like there's some, you may feel tied or to a situation like this is just too much. Maybe you just want to just run out, run off from this situation because it's too many rules. Okay. It's too many rules. And then they're judging you by the things that you do or how you do things. Why is the Knight of Pentacles here? Okay, things, the process is moving slowly. Like, you're ready for things to pick up, but things, the process is moving, like, slowly, okay? The process is moving slowly. Six of Swords. Yeah, and then you, there you are waiting for things to pick up. And they do. It does pick up, okay? But it starts off kind of slower. Maybe you're just looking at it like, you know what? Things are just not moving fast enough. I need to move faster. I need to move faster. But it does eventually pick up, okay? Things do pick up. Things eventually do pick up, okay? But I just feel like maybe you feel like Something is too controlling and there's too many rules, okay? And you're ready to get the hell on. You're ready to leave this situation. So you looked at an opportunity presented itself in the past, and now you're like, you know, I'm ready to get, you know, I'm ready to move on from this. What's new? You know, and the process does finally pick up, okay? The process does finally pick up in the future, all right? All right, Virgos, I hope this reading was helpful for you guys. And until next time, my loves, ciao for now.